particularly didn't like to say that in that particular manner, but there we go. Um, somebody has said this to me, usually somebody from the military. I don't know for sure. I've never been there. It just doesn't interest me. I really like to be well behaved and be in control and have the right to think things through and um, respond to anybody speaking to me or giving me a directive with uh, logic and reason and a list of rules using everything in my being and in my past and in my understanding of the law and society and God. Um, for that reason, I have never entertained at all joining the military. Nonetheless, I, I cannot sit back and watch um, our military even becoming more of a it's more of a group of people from all over the world working together which idealistically is a good thing but they're all able to go off and hold the guns in other countries and say they're Canadian yet their ancestry their roots their heritage the voices over their heads the spirits in the sky sort of thing sometimes truly are not from our own ideology. Sometimes they're from ideologies that are completely opposed to Canada and its democracy and the democracy of the um, Allies. Just from what I've been witnessing quietly over the years, albeit speaking, but not feeling as if sometimes I'm um, more so being spoken by the spirits of the dead. We are the dead short days ago. Take up our quarrel with the foe. To you with failing hands, we throw the torch be yours to hold it high. When I moved to Ontario as a young mother <clears throat> with my new husband, um, I moved from a, an isolated community up north where I was permitted to achieve very, very well in a very, very strong education system which received funding from a <clears throat> very, very well-established wealthy company, which allowed us to have the best of everything and um, use it to our best ability if we so desired. And I received a similar education in the Newfoundland education system using Canada student loans and grants, <clears throat> even though my father had um, been laid off and um, been part of a shutdown previous to us attending university, we weren't held 